The world's environmental challenges are interconnected and complex. At the University of Maryland Center for Environmental Science, UMSIS, renowned researchers are working on solutions. The Chesapeake Bay and its watershed are our laboratory. One of the powerful parts of UMSIS is that it is comprehensive. Mountains to the sea, sky to the bottom of the bay, microbes to ecosystems. We all need clean air to breathe, clean water to drink. We need healthy forests. We need sustainable agriculture, sustainably produced food. But there's major environmental challenges that threaten our natural resources. We bring together collaborative teams, interdisciplinary teams of scientists to help address these big challenges both here in Maryland and throughout the world. What I think is so unique about UMSIS is its ability to innovate and be nimble in the problems that it addresses. And these can be coastal problems at the Chesapeake Bay local level, or these can be global problems. The future of the Chesapeake Bay is tied into our individual actions now, but also forces that are well beyond the borders of the Chesapeake Bay. Changes in climate, changes in water level are all going to be challenges moving into the future. UMSIS is unique in the depth and breadth of its expertise and its legacy of collaboration. No one takes a more extensive view of this remarkable watershed and is able to apply it to systems around the world. For the past hundred years, this institution has been working hard to understand the ecology and the biology of the natural resources, oysters, crabs, striped bass, menhaden. The lessons that we're learning about greenhouse gases in, in a local estuary like the Chesapeake Bay can then go global. And we can take that knowledge and go not just from the estuary, but into the land itself, into the rivers, into agricultural systems, and then take it even further, like the Arctic. One of the really unique parts of UMSIS is that we have this duality. That is, we're mandated to do really good world-class research on the one hand, and on the other hand, to apply it, use it for the public good. We face many complex environmental challenges that have not just science elements, but political, social, cultural, ethical elements to them. So we need to really hear from a diversity of perspectives, experiences, expertise in order to study and solve these problems. And it's in this environment that UMSIS prepares the next generation of environmental leaders. Graduate students are always moving, and I feel like they are the heart and the blood of UMSIS, and they really keep everything going. The thing that makes me the most optimistic is the outstanding graduate students that we produce, because those graduate students will continue their work for decades to come, and they are highly motivated to address some of the challenges that are facing us. UMSI's role as trusted scientific advisor is more important than ever, and its groundbreaking research has changed the way we think about the environment. There is more to do, and all who share a passion for the Chesapeake Bay, its land, and its people have a role. I think there's a lot of value in being curious about our environment and discovering new things in our environment. Getting new data, discovering novel things, that's really exciting. And then being able to flesh it out and sort of see how the whole thing is put together, that's really exciting. Our ability to collect data has outpaced the speed that we can analyze it. And so a lot of the work that is on the horizon is taking all this data that we have and trying to analyze it to understand you know, what it can tell us about the estuary. Well, we care, I mean, if we want to find solutions, we have to understand what's happening. It's easy to think that on one person, what I do doesn't really matter, but the activities of us individually and collectively as a whole really matter for what happens in terms of our environment, and we have big environmental challenges that we need to be addressing. The science and technology that comes out of UMSIS is already making a difference in people's lives. There's much more work for us to do, and we're positioned to do it. I think it's important that we leave the world a better place than we found it. 
and I am hopeful that the scientific solutions that we develop here at UMSEs will help lead to a more sustainable and more resilient world.